Hello and welcome to Switch Fun Day. Something a little different today, it's Cassette Beasts. But this is because if you subscribe to Nintendo Switch Online, it's a free game trial. So I wanted to check it out. I'm always interested in Pokemon sort of esque games, you know, monster collectors. And this had so much love earlier in the year. I never kind of forgot about it. It's like wishlisted on PlayStation and Switch, and so when I get a chance to play it, I really want to try it. As you can see, it's fully updated. I think it's like 1.6.2. I'm just going to play solo. I'm going to do about an hour or so, I think. I'm from the generation that grew up with cassette tapes, CDs, mini discs. So any sort of media like that really, it's really fun. Name. Let's do the usual character name for RPGs. Favourite colour. Genuinely, I like a good sort of navy blue. So I think eight's the closest we're going to get. Now I can't spin the character around, but you can see the sprite character is moving. I do like this character creator. Often creators, you got to zoom in and out yourself. You got you've got to physically move the camera. Here, the game is. You know, we see zoomed in and we see zoomed out. The zoomed out is moving around. That's a really cool way of doing it. And there's a lot to choose from. I liked the um, side one. I mean, that's kind of cool. Hair color. How should we go crazy? Purple look kind of nice actually. So is that red? Oh, darkish blue. Oh man, you can have some real fun in this character creator. I like that one. <laughs> okay. I think we'll keep that. You just need to hit plus. This is a weird little intro screen, isn't it? I guess when we've been Izakaid to somewhere, maybe. Typically on a loading screen, just get one of these funny little things. So this game's throwing all sorts of funny little sentences at us. So going in, I genuinely don't know much, if anything, about this game. I just remember a lot of podcasters talking about it. Oh, huh, okay, so it is. Okay, so I kind of dig the style. So D-pad can move and so can analog stick. Well, that music got epic pretty quick. <sighs> kind of neither. Well, I guess I'd perhaps say more sweet. Yeah. convenient that person had a spare cassette deck. <laughs> A 
we transform into that? Okay. Yeah, the controller's vibrating. Right. I wonder what the cord does. I, I suppose. See, on the left, we got red dots underneath our names. I'm guessing Spit uses no red dots. But that will use one. We've only got two red dots. So he's gonna hit Spit. Kinda surprised the game didn't point that out. Scroll very smoothly. There was a lot of stuttering, that was very weird. Yeah, what is this place? <laughs> You're stuck, okay. So, have we been izakai Have we been Wonderful. brought here, like transported? <sighs> Again, draw. Most games will do this text and ask us if we want it to be automated or something. But here, not quite. So, in some respects. It feels a little old in that respect. A lot of more modern games, especially mobile games, that automatically scroll the text. New rule. I'm afraid not. They all come in, that's the thing. No one's ever got out. I'm guessing that's gonna be what we need to do. Oh, A is dash. Why is this so fun? Okay, so this is just the wardrobe is What's the letterbox doing inside the house? Yeah. No, but I don't know what the online stuff is all about. Yeah, it does look good on the Switch. He says that as if there's no other city or town or place in this game world. He says we're an island, but are there no other islands? Center. Huh. <sighs> so there 
is more, but we can't get there. You can see the bridge is out or up. Oh, this is the clinic. Welcome. Goodbye. <laughs> Just came and say hi. She says goodbye. Fine. How rude. to think about it it doesn't make sense sure that's one way for the game to get past that whole uh, jump in logic just uh, don't think about it no ah. 101 years okay I don't think we're gonna find anyone that old, but sorry. So there are some older residents. It's a little weird how few grass there is on this Switch version. I wonder if other console versions have richer landscapes with more interactable things or just see that looks like a decent amount of grass so you can just walk off the edge huh obviously you can't climb it but you... it's like there's no jumping animation that popping well hmm. I wonder if this game is actually pushing the switch quite hard see shadows popping in tech we had whole items just pop in Oh, we can just fall in the water? I'm so used to games stopping you going where you can't go. I've actually got to pay a little bit of attention. Thankfully, uh... there's no um, health bar for us just walking around. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> So we actually have to deal with it. Yeah, her character didn't get out of the way either. Okay, so now there's a tutorial for this. I guess there was a little bit of an info dump at the beginning. As the characters themselves said, so I'm kind of spacing out a little bit, okay. doesn't look that great. What would really help is if there's like a Pokedex of sorts that will help put it into perspective. Like it pretends it has a cape because it wants to be a superhero kind of thing. Is it?
I obtain a sonic boom. How did I do that? Yeah. In A, I want, I want A to be the confirm. Yeah, I saw a hole in the wall, but it wasn't that obvious. So I've recorded two of them. Okay, so my health hasn't returned. Oh, let's just focus on one. I wonder why we outsped it. Is it because we're a higher level, maybe? I'm kind of surprised the game hasn't showed us a way to view our individual monster stats so we can see. So I don't know if our speed is related to us, the player, or us, the monster. We've got another one. How do we get these? Show us how to do that then. Is that a monster in the back there? Well, let's check out. We have no tapes, huh? Nothing there. Let's have a rest. Well, hopefully the rest is going to heal us. They haven't explicitly said that yet. Like, are we expected to use items to heal us, or will just camping heal us? With just this. It's night now. What's party do? Well, it looks like it's, we're healed. Check tape. Interesting, so stickers is a good way of doing that. So, we do not have stickers. I didn't explain why it's two star and why that one's one star. seems that using the tape raises our base stats like speed only goes up by 3 85 to 88 but max HP goes up by 18 there are quite a few intricacies about this that haven't really been explained to us just yet like is it a good thing that it's now night time I don't know will this dude up here comment about it being night, I wonder. Haha, <laughs> okay. Using a pen or pencil to rewind a cassette. Yeah, I've done that. Often, like the cassette players you'd have, rewinding a fast forward used more battery. So if your battery is really low, one way you could do is just mm. manually do it. And then you'd have enough battery to play it one more time maybe. Why 
does she want him to come over here, I wonder? Does she want to catch it? We got a lot from that. How do we... Oh. Where's all this sound coming from? just starts there. I don't know how to get back up. Ah, oh, jump. Can we jump this? No. What's this? We are meant to go this way. Hi. That's just the game blocking that off. Okay. Ah, she's a smack to start with. It's going to take several turns then. Let's try that. Hopefully that'll work. Ooh, cool scary face. don't heal. Does that mean game over? Well, they want us to get that monster over, so... Oh, if it's a moth, they might want a lamp turned on. Did that, yeah, it just came after us. So it didn't like the light, did it? See, I need three. There's only two up, so do that. He hasn't been mentioned yet. So how would we know? There's not even like a type triangle on the screen to give help. I do feel like this game could have done a better job for new players. Because here we are in a situation where the type triangles or our type triangle has been brought up. The game offers no hints or help. I also don't want to heal because so I want to see what happens because the game hasn't told me what happens if one of our characters faints. leveled up but there's no nothing there that shows of our stats go up
show us how to do it then. We don't know about rarity of monsters yet. That's cool. At least we can't knock it out if we have started to record it. Oh, it's just that. interesting is that the monster itself didn't then disappear. Right. If you notice my health is also back to normal now. Not expecting that. That's an interesting Sorry. idea. Obviously, it's not something that's common in other like Pokemon games. You use helpers, but here uh, they've given us abilities. guys are very annoyed oh, too quick there's a little bit too obvious the texture pop in well I say textures is general items isn't it trees Huh? Other things are happening. It just pops in. It's a little distracting because there's so little in the game. When it happens, it's like a whole thing just appears. <laughs> what? What? Isn't this normal? It says investigate the structure. There's no like heal area. Well, let's check it out. Huh? Really? 
Train station? That well, wasn't my first guess. Burning metal. She one of his a retribution. Which you wonder if, if this is a straight up game or if there's like a horror aspect or some other twist that I don't know about because I only casually heard people talking about it. That's unusual. That's a cool effect when I went to pencil. Use an item. Use on. Where's the health? It says fully restore HP. So I, oh, um. Well, this is the one I'm using. It's just you would have thought it would. If we're restoring health, it would show us the health of the ones that can be restored. How weird. Some interest. Interesting decisions here. Let's see what that looks like. I think there's want other monsters joining us in the fight. Nope. Okay then. It would have been nice to know all that before. doing any damage, does it? Uh. I refuse. Okay, was not expecting fusion. Huh. The next question is, where's the fusion meter? Huh. This was... unexpected. Well, we need to watch out, because their AP is about to attack us. So I need to do things like get evasion up. Well, I guess we'll do dodge again. Did not help. <laughs> Did 
I don't have a, like, a move for defense. Lowers their evasion. I guess I can raise my attack. Interesting. So evasion and dodge wasn't a percentage. I thought it was like plus three or plus two or whatever. But no, what it was showing was how many moves left it has. So I don't know if my two dodges add up to like a plus two dodge or if it just meant it would last twice as long. <laughs> that kind of feels like a waste. Again, it feels like the tutorial really should have um, prepared us for aspects of battle. If we start the game with a move that we can dodge, tell us about it. Tell us about how that system works. Enough. I want to go home. Interesting. Yeah, vessel. Very well. <laughs> what? Is it just going in our heads? We nailed the vessel. Hmm. Confusing. Conversations are a little off. I don't know, it's weird. how the music just stopped <laughs> kind of took it at me out of that a little bit there I was kind of enjoying the music in the background and then hmm. it just stops Okay, so there's a relationship. 
aspect of the game. I would just know so I wonder if all the quests are going to be cliched music titles. I want to see where we need to go on the map. Interactable. Bonjour. I am Clemence. It'll be fun if records were collectibles in the world. So when you come back to the cafe, you could put them on and listen to them. fun. That's a fun way of doing like a repel. I would like another tape at least. So here's just one. Okay. Au revoir. I should think about adding to my squad. Unexpected. <sighs> yeah. This is not vampires because it seems to be daytime. Details, that's why I asked them. <laughs> Where? Is it that's the same place as the other one though, isn't it? Shadows are. Yeah, that's a little weird. Hey. Oh. I guess we get a spare word, sure. Three hundred. I was gonna say, if I've got some like five or ten, I can give him. See, how do I look up how much wood I have in total? Is it X? I'm not too far away, am I?
None of those seem to be particularly useful to my situation. talk it does seem like they are not here because they died so it mean like Isekai's you end up somewhere because you died but here in this game it doesn't seem like that's the reason anti-monsters okay Some snakes, a platform higher there. A wind stopping us from going that way, okay. How oh, they get up there? See, I can't pick up that wood. to be here because the game just stopped to load not as seamless as like on a pocketable handheld and now I'm here and I can't do anything I've got to trigger a load again haven't I ah maybe not Sing. Huh. Okay. Whoa, you see that? Oh, that's our friend. It's a cool little water effect. The rain looks kind of fun. I seem to rather pointless because if that is a pressure pad, it did nothing. Ah, it's so easy to push that one. Ooh, creepy. I'm worried that this is going to be. A lot more dangerous, okay. Um, let's just leave. If that is really as dangerous as they say it is. I was wondering if it was like some unknown monster that would appear when we fight it. Maybe it was camouflaged or something, I don't know. It could be anything in a game like this. towards hey another one of those moth creatures the uh, ranger station hey you hmm. are we gonna watch okay then. Yeah, that level 60 that one on the left there. But what was the point of all that? I 
I expected this, but I did not expect the um, bridge to then appear. It's a hole in the ground. Come on. I was wondering if you were meant to dig. Ah, some other person. Okay. Cool. Fast travel is useful. These moth creatures don't seem to be worried about us. What's this creature though? Well... Oh, it's a man in a hard hat. I thought it was like a fire one. I'm Wallace. There's a random electricity pole here. Huh? Oh, okay. Fusion on the right there, you see that next to the cord? I'll take a little water to get that up though. Oh, was not expecting that. That's interesting. monster though. It's the skull that makes that weird. A crab with a traffic cone. I can believe it, but the fact that it's a monster standing on a skull, it doesn't look quite white to me. It doesn't, it doesn't work with what the other monsters we've seen in the world either. Looks like fusion might build over time. Haha! <laughs> I wondered. Lightning types, okay. See that? There was another one down there. You can't spin the camera yourself, it's gonna do it. The game's gonna spin the camera. into the conversation. Archangels. Well. Huh? Sure I'll apply, but Kaylee is kinda of hinting that wants us to apply <laughs> so we can do more Archangel stuff. Yeah, I knew. You have all the information. They're top. Huh. 
so ranger captains are like gyms essentially. Right. Of course I have that. <laughs> Basically, it looks like the game has now really opened up for us to do what we want. So that's that uh, fusion, I think. Why can't I heal and sleep here? Horns latte. That's a weird little monster thing. Oh, it's not a map of the world we could just take. Okay. Oh. Well, we've got someone down here. Yes, we haven't healed. I'm wondering about Kaylee. How do we get Kaylee to have another monster? Unless they use this pool here, like we do. Need to rewind her. Oh, they're using a lot of attacks that lower. when we learned bite either it's not when our monsters learn a move there's no big fanfare around it Am I helpless is that one new okay she's saying that over here they're Higher level, and perhaps we shouldn't mess around with it. I haven't really seen any what I would call like rare spawns. The monsters we've seen have been the same ones we've seen for a while now. It doesn't seem to be like a like two percent chance of a monster appearing. I meant to get back up there. Can't I? Oh yeah, open. It won't open. Huh. Wonder why. Be really interesting to see if there are like shiny monsters. That's some um, one up there with the uh, helmet. I want to fight that one. It's different. You see that pause? That wasn't me. Right. I thought that would be a two-on-two -two battle, maybe. I bet they're gonna fuse together to make one giant snake. It's 
still interesting. We're, what, an hour in now, and we haven't even been introduced to the type charts. I could not tell you what type they are, nor can I tell you what it will take to defeat them. Sound. Cool name. We'll see what it looks like. Yeah, it's not bad. Aww. It looks like Dominoff wasn't earning XP, just waiting in the background. Maybe we actually have to use them. I kind of need a fast travel back home. Because our health are so low. But maybe Doctor is what we need? Which one's the Doctor? This one? Katie's place, so no. Is it this? There's no like hospital sign on it. Welcome. Hmm? <laughs> if that's all. Why don't we just get prescribed to go home and just rest on our own house? Why is it the Gramophone Cafe? Wait. It's the cafe upstairs and our home is downstairs, is it? Stupid question. Let's just say cat. Is that it? That's it. What quest we got? going. So the main quest seem to be the main ones. We've got 118 and it says how many we've obtained. Oh Eugene was over there on the far right. If I set that to track, that one, that's with the exclamation mark. Well, exclamation mark might be a new one or the latest. No, it's pointing us. Okay. Well, we're what? A little over an hour in. I think it's a good place to save. I call it a day. So, cassette beats. You know, I'm glad I tried it on the game trial. It's the full game, so it downloads the full game, but there's a time limit. Unlike the old PlayStation Plus hour trials, this is like a week to try it. Um, I don't think I'm going to buy it. I don't know. The first hour just isn't grabbing me. The conversations I'm having feel weird, almost unnatural in some respects, and... I don't know, just expected the game to explain itself a little bit more. 
Looks like it's... I don't know why it's holding back certain information, but giving us a lot of other information. It has some neat ideas, but I don't even know what the type triangles are. I don't know what type versus what type, I don't know what symbols mean. They're some of the real basic things the game hasn't taught us, and yet the game has introduced overarching narratives. I don't know, I think they've got their priorities a little off for the introduction phase of the game. Um, if you have it, played it, or completed it, let me know in the comments. It'd be interesting to hear your opinion. It could be that the start is rough and then after a couple of hours it really gains momentum and gets going. Or it could be now that the world's opened up, that's now it's fun and easier. I don't know, I just feel like for an introduction, it's not great. I mean, the music isn't grabbing me either. It almost feels like the music's louder than it needs to be. And I'm trying to read and someone's singing in my ear. Do I really need that? I would have loved if there was an option in the character creator music. Do you like to listen to instrumentals or people singing? And if that would have led to the game having instrumental music, I would have gone with instrumentals. This guitar playing in the background, it's lovely. Why can't I have instrumental stuff playing? <laughs> At least the battle music's not bad. But I don't know. It also feels like, despite how far we've gone, not a huge variety. Hmm. Except it doesn't... And the nostalgia doesn't kind of grab me either. Yes, I grew up with cassettes. Still have a bunch of them, but I guess it's not hitting the kind of nostalgia that I would expect from it. I'll probably keep the save, and it may, if I did play it, if I got it like PlayStation Plus, got it that way, maybe I would start again, try again, and hopefully the game would run smoother. The pop in is a little frustrating. Loading is a little frustrating, and then we had that whole freeze for what two, three seconds? Very bizarre. But anyway, that'll do for Switch Fun Day. So until the next Switch Fun Day video, or until I see you checking out some of the other videos, playlists, YouTube shorts, or even live streams we do, or maybe I'll see you over at Kofi. As a small YouTube channel, we get no money from YouTube, but with Kofi, we can get donations, including PayPal donations, so we've got some subscription tiers. So maybe one of them will trust you. But wherever or whenever I see you again, please take care.